I want to give an update real quick on the trip that we're supposed to take as a group to Nairobi, Kenya. Originally, we had 20 spots open to go on this trip. Now we have about 13 spots left to go on this trip. Uh, make sure if you want to go on the trip with us to put down your $500 deposit on the link that's in the pinned comment, and then you can work with Worldviews Travel to uh, find out if you want to do bi-weekly or monthly payments. But I have a video on one of the places that we're going to stay. Actually, when we get to Nairobi. Um, Kia is one of the travel agents and she's actually in Nairobi right now, but she sent me some video just so you guys can see it as well. But let's go ahead and roll those short clips. So this is just for you, Phil. We are taking a tour of Kabinsky. This is the superior room. So this is what, and this is for a single occupancy. Yes, mm -hmm. or double, yeah. Cool. So it's that discount. Yeah, the phone is uh, international direct dial. Really? Yes, you don't need to go through the operator. You can just dial directly and. Uh, Wherever in the world you will get to connect. And there's no charge? No, it is charged. Okay, yes. I was about to say. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay. The, the socket is multinational, any adapter will fit. Okay. So you don't have to buy special adapters to plug. Okay. Then this is the next with the Wi Fi and cable accessible. Mm -hmm. Yes, the TV is interactive. You can do plug and play. If you have presentations, you can prepare here. Okay. Yes. And also another thing about the TV, when you have a message, it will just pop up. Cool. For someone sleeping things under a door. Wow. <laughs> okay. Then you offer a complimentary mini bar, mm -hmm. which is restocked every day. Wow. Yeah, it has soft drinks and snacks. Okay. Yes. <laughs> nice. Mm. The bed, this is a king bed. Mm -hmm. Though we usually do our duvets, this is our style of how we lay the bed. Mm -hmm. There are not two beds joined together. Oh, it's just the way they style it. Okay, yes. cool. But if you need the big duvet, we can offer. Okay. Mm. Okay, so this is the second room. This is the executive suite. And you get a separate, separate shower and toilet and bathroom that goes, ooh, do sink. It goes into the room. That is nice, very nice. So all amenities are the same for all the rooms. The difference is usually the size. Right. Yeah. So from suits upwards, you'll find more some additions, like a coffee making machine. We have a bigger hallway. Yeah. But the, the main difference is usually the size. And you get a view of the city. Nice, okay. So, any questions? No, sir. This is the bar. Okay, so we're in the bar area. Is this where we'll be eating? Is this where we'll be eating breakfast? No. No. Okay. Very nice, very nice. Oh, nice. Wow. This is where we be eating our breakfast, Phil. Okay? Your subscribers are going to love this. this is very nice. So you have buffet style? Yes. Oh, wow. Look how clean it is. They're going to love this, Phil. Just wanted to give you a glimpse. And uh, it's our standard to offer a minimum of 100 items for breakfast. What? Yeah. Say that again? 100 items. He said it's a standard that it's 100 items minimum for breakfast. So they'll have over 100 or 100 items to choose for, for just breakfast. Okay, that's cool. Doesn't look like a mud hood, do it? So 
you will be staying in that particular venue. It's nice. You'll feel like a king or queen. You know, it'd be great if you know couples go or shoot, even if you want to say, man, I'm going by myself or whatever. Go. Have a good time. Take that plunge to go to Africa. Because I know they'll try to scare you and say, oh, look at all the shots you may have to take or whatever. You know how I many shots these people try to make your child take to live here? So what about if you have to have one or two? Oh, well. And then some countries, you don't have to have it at all um, if you come from a na certain nations, I'm going to say. So that shouldn't stop you from going. Now, remember, everything with this is all inclusive. You don't have to come out of pocket for food. You don't have to come out of pocket for uh, the transportation. You don't have to come out of pocket for the flights. Everything is taken care of. All of it. All that you have to pay for over there is just something you want to buy, you know, for yourself, your family, etc. But it's all taken care of. When I went to Ethiopia, it wasn't like that. So we had to get our own drivers. We had to get, um, you know, tour people. We had to do everything like that. This situation, everything is taken care of. It's just easy for you. Only thing that you have to do outside of having your money with you just to buy things is just your flight to JFK and then back home. Other than that, I mean, it's all taken care of. So we definitely would love to, you know, meet a lot of you. Um, like I said, I'm definitely going, of course, it's a uh, group trip. You know, this is something that you guys requested from, you know, us to do. This is not nothing that I thought on my own to say, oh, I want to do a group trip that you guys asked. So we're trying to offer that. As I stated before, we have 13 spots. Uh, left. So make sure you jump on them because I tell people all the time, you know, that last minute thing is not always a good thing. The $500 deposits go way up to uh, January 31st. After that, it goes up to $1,200 deposit. So I would suggest to jump on it now. And that's, and you have months, you have a lot of months to pay off your uh, trip. Cause some people may say, Oh, it's a lot of money. Not when you're you paying payments. It's not, you know I mean, you could just, you have to think about that. Sometimes we, as black people in America, we go through so much. And a lot of times we fearful to pull that trigger sometime when it comes to finances, sometimes your peace of mind is worth spending the money. Trust me on that. It is dealing with this racism and white supremacy that we deal with every day. You know, the way our children are treated the way, um, you know, we're treated on the job. Uh, we blatantly see white supremacy in front of us every freaking day. It has an a, effect on us. So when you could actually get out of Babylon for at least a little bit and go to the continent and actually see, you don't have to deal with any of that, at least just for a week it would do you very well. Trust me on that. I wouldn't keep advocating this if I didn't experience it myself when I went to Ethiopia. So make sure guys, you click the link in the pinned comment, 13 spots left is first come first serve. And we'll see you on the next update video.